So the the intention for today's meeting is we've we've had folks kind of going through the metrics here, getting them into the new template, and making sure that they've added you know like those the permalinks, um, kind of getting our uh, declarations to like GDPR stuff, kind of getting everything a little bit more organized because many of our metrics, as you know, still had old disclaimers at the top of them. They uh, they were like some of them were in templates that were like from feels like a hundred years ago. Uh, so we've at least made a very concerted effort um, to get all the metrics kind of looking and formatted the same. Uh, by no means is it done at this point, but it's come a long way. So my hope was is to take a little bit of time and honestly just have people go through metrics and see if they can identify any issues with the metrics. So one of the big things that we did was we have this question in an overview section, which was, if you recall, the combination of mm, description and objectives, maybe. I kind of forget what the other two. Remember, it used to be two sections at the top. So we just wanted to simplify that. We have this want to know more section. Oh, whoops. So that contains objectives, which it shouldn't. <laughs> For example, <laughs> here's a good example. So like this objectives needs to be removed and kind of thought in the sense of this overview. So that's just something we need to do. We don't have to do it in this group. I'm just trying to catch problems. So it would contain data collection strategies, filters, visualizations, um, and then making sure we have references, the contributors, and this additional information section, and then this the GDPR stuff down below. So I can see immediately that this one has an issue that we need to solve. So this is really all I want to do today is just spend time kind of going through these metrics and documenting um, a few things that we see where, might need to be addressed. Where, yep. where are we capturing the notes for these? Well, I, I don't know. So this is I in like I'm not sure how we would want. I wasn't expecting this many people. <laughs> I was expecting like, <laughs> like two people and I'd say, okay, you know, person one, just start at the top of this column, person two, start at the top of this column, person three, just start at the bottom of this column, person four, start at the, you know what I mean? And we can slowly work our way uh, through these columns. Um, so my thought is, is we could just simply take the notes here, Kevin, you know, like if you have a metric, you would just, write, you know, metric name and then the issue. You know what I mean? Like, you need to remove the objectives section from want to know more. Something like that. Okay. I would make, I, I would, I would like to make one request on everyone looking at these metrics uh, because it's kind of a reoccurring problem we have with the metrics. Uh, in that overview, yeah. the first one to two sentences of the overview should explicitly say what the metric is measuring. So it shouldn't be a, a oftentimes we get in we kind of get into some some language where we where we start talking about this metric is important because of all of these reasons. Uh, that part kind of belongs to the second half of the of the overview. Uh, and we can think of that as the objectives. But the, the first one to two sentence of every metric should, it should explicitly say what we're measuring. If that, does that make sense to everyone? It does. Um, so just structurally, we, let me find. Yeah, for example, in this one, that, that opening line. Yeah. Uh, a lot of these done. It kind of it it frames it like we're trying to make an argument why the metric is important, where which which we we kind of we talk about with the objectives a little bit, but that first sentence should say this metric measures this, right? Um, could we do that like in a in the next round? Could I make a note of that? Like the language i was just trying to get the template stuff down oh just the, okay well never mind then yeah that's fine no not never mind but i'll, I'll capture that so um 
for next pass, like ensure, well, let me make sure I'm getting this right. Ensure that the first like sentence or two like that. If, if we look at the template, there is, there is guidance on how to construct that overview. Uh, and that guidance will say, basically in the first, the first one to two sentences explicitly say what the metric is, is doing. And then the, uh, the second, the third and fourth sentence is something along the lines of uh, why the metric is important or, or what it helps measure. And then I think the, the fifth sentence is possibly something, how it might relate to diversity, equity, and inclusion. Okay. Uh, but so there is guidance in the template board. It's just, it's making sure, sure that this overview matches the guidance in the template. Okay. Can we, can I do that in a, in the next pass on this? Yeah, that, that's fine. I, I, okay. uh, uh, we're just looking at structurally if the template matches here. Is, yeah, exactly. is what we're looking. Okay. Like I, see, I see a number already right now. Like if I looked at like Libyers, I could just see that like it's not. Well, that one's actually pretty good. Overview, want to know more. You know what I mean? And just making sure that it goes into data collection strategies, filters, and visualizations. You know, so like that one looks pretty good. Whether or not the content is right, I just want to make sure structurally. Good. Does that make sense? Yeah. All right. So the structure. Okay. So the structure is is um, a title and a question, and then a section called overview with some narrative of what this is about, and then a section just called want to know more. And that should contain potentially three headings, data collection strategies, filters, and visualizations. And it's a collapsible section. And we have references, contributors, and then the additional information is like a link to actually make changes, the stable URL, and then this disclaimer at the bottom. Does, that, does anybody have questions on that? I think many of us have been involved in this retemplating. Does anyone have the uh, the link to the metrics template handy? It might no. be. It would be it would be nice to put it at the top of the page, because we. In the I would imagine it's, in the future we'll probably use it's here. it quite often. Or is it so it's in the, it's at least in this document right now. Oh, it's in the spreadsheet. Okay. Yeah. So you can get to it there. So there's the template right there. I think I got it on every one of them too. So it should be updated across all of them, but not in this. It's not currently in our minutes. <clears throat> all right. Uh, oops, not the head. It's up there now. All right, so what I'm asking is, this is gonna be a, a working session. If I'm gonna give people an option, if you don't wanna work on this, that's okay, I understand. <laughs> and you can take off. Um, but if you do, I'm just gonna kind of stop sharing my screen. And I think we could just kind of start, maybe I'll start at the top upper right. So is everybody gonna stick around? Two, four. So, I yeah. I have a proposal. I put in the meeting minutes, the list of all metrics, and we can mark our progress in here. Okay, just so, and you can just kind of grab whichever one you want, how about? Yeah. So maybe if you're about ready to look at licenses declared, just put your name on it really fast. Something like that, yeah. Okay. I, I might I might actually drop because I, I was planning on multitasking during the meeting. So that was oh, okay. no problem. <laughs> Sorry. No uh, problem. We're before... going to be sick this weekend. And so I have a whole bunch of stuff I need to get done before I leave That's tomorrow. Absolutely no problem. I just before you <laughs> leave Don, I added um, a new metric that came out of the last meeting. The issue comments. If you want to take a look at that. Okay. I don't understand, Gary. Where did you add it? In the both in the chat and at the bottom of our notes to meeting minutes today. 
Oh, okay. I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna flag that that it doesn't match the template. <laughs> okay, go for it. <laughs> All right, cool. So, um, and, so bye, Don. Thank you. All right, thank you. Oh, you where are we making are we making direct edits to a markdown document no just go ahead and put it in here first just so in the meeting minutes yeah just put your whatever you're seeing as a comment like looks good i see okay i got it or you just say it's it's not in the new template at all would probably be one thing one thing that shows up or one of the headers is misplaced those seem to be the three most common things that you would write. And here's the template. Yep, I got the template. All right. Cool. All right, I'm going to stop my share. I'm going to pause the recording.